power zone. Man, that's a lot of general aviation planes right there. Yeah, it's crazy busy out here. Yeah, I was looking at the. I guess they don't let they don't let them fly into uh, McCarran. Well, you, know, you can, but you got to pay a fee. Yeah. yeah. All right, nineteen four is departure, right? Yep. Put our route. Station three zero zero Julia Whiskey. I assume you'll be ready upon reaching. A affirmative. For three zero zero Julia Whiskey Rudder, runway three five left, cleared for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, three five left, three hundred Julia Whiskey. Oh, we're not going to hurry, right? Right. Just because you got us. Yeah. My lineup items is the lights and the pitot static. So now you got it to idle. Yep. Not quite. But now we do. Faster. There you go. All right. We'll slow down a little bit before we round the corner. All righty. And then I'm going to get lights. Pedo heats. The pedo heats are limited to two minutes. That's why I try not to turn them on too soon, right? Okay. We'll get out there. We'll gas on it nice and smooth. Yep. You can wait till you get centered before you really gas on it. All you right. know? Yeah. All right. Just keep us coming around. And your feet are on the floor. Yeah. Just using the uh, bottom part of the right, yep. Because we don't want to drag the brakes. Just like yeah, a, just like a, anybody else, right? Nobody's coming. That's not a person. That's an on departure in. We'll get lined up completely, like I said, yep. and then you'll psh, give her the beans. All right. <laughs> oh. And it won't let us turn until we get to whatever it's supposed to do, right? Right. That's All right. So get it nice and centered. You overshot a little bit. That's yeah, right. Get it nice and straight. Now start gassing on it. Nice and smooth and symmetrical. They're they're good. Now go three clicks. There you go. That, yeah, that's top. All right, two and takeoff powers achieved. Airspeed's yep. alive. Okay. What, right. What's Panels right? clean. There's 70 knot cross checks. I'll call out V1. When I say that, you take your hand off and put it on the yoke. All right. So V1, rotate. Go ahead and pull back. Keep pulling. Pitch up to your V bars. Right. Yep. Pause the rate. Gear, gear comes up. Y'all damp off, and you just fly the V bars. All right. right? Yep. V2 plus 10. I'm gonna pull your power or flaps go up. Okay. Power back to climb. All right. And then I'm going to hit VNAV, flight level change, and you just follow your view your bars, right? Yep. It's intercepting it. It's going to go to 6,000. And it's magenta, so we know it's going to do Over it. Over 300, yep. Julia Whiskey, contact departure. Have a safe flight. Over to departure, 300, Julia Whiskey. Good day. And then you can trim, right? You got electric trim. Okay, cool. So trim whatever you need. All right. Departure citation, 300, Julia Whiskey, 3.6, climbing 6,000. Let's see there's Julie Whiskey, Las Vegas Pro Titan, Las Vegas Altimeter 2985. 85, three, uh, Julie Whiskey. Alright, good looking across. Take contact 2 miles north of Fenderson, climb of 18, 1 to 1,000. 10,000, Julie Whiskey. So now we can avoid that 6, right? Yep, we just keep on climbing up to 10. But we're still going to follow the V bars, right? Right. Technically, we'll see what it does. It's going to probably capture you six. Gotcha. Now it's accelerating. 58 contact tower, yeah. 118.75. Light yeah. level change. So we're going to do 18. 250 now. So lower the nose a little bit. 75, right. change 358. That's a little bit below the uh, flight direction. No, no, no. You'll, it'll, it'll, it'll do it, Greg. Right. Clear, okay. direct night. Climb and maintain flight level 1 Anderson. What was the fix? November, India, India, Tango Zulu. Okay, direct nits and 19,000, zero drilling whiskey. There you go. And now I'm going to vertical speed you. Sorry, it's in capture. You're fine. 19. I'm trying to get it in there quick for you. Vertical uh -huh. speed. Zero drilling whiskey, contact Las Vegas departure, 133.9 or 5. 33.95, zero drilling whiskey. Good day. Thirty-three ninety-five. So now it's going to do two twenty, right? Because yep. I got VNAV flight level change, and we're going in nits. I couldn't understand what he was saying. Archer citation three hundred Juliet whiskey seven point seven climbing one nine zero. Citation three hundred Juliet whiskey. Thank you and maintain flight level one hundred zero for two direct nights. One nine zero direct nights zero Juliet whiskey. There's Joe Julie Whiskey, just expedite through on 1-2000, crossing traffic, please. Okay, we'll hurry through 12, Zero Julie Whiskey. 
I think doing the two doing flight level change. We're doing three thousand foot a minute. So yeah, yeah, we're doing pretty good. good. <laughs> pretty damn good, huh? Yeah, yeah. I won't get the light off. Alrighty. Uh, when do you usually turn the pitot static heat off? You leave them on oh, all the time. Them, okay. The whole flight. So just two minutes on the ground is the restriction. Yeah, because okay. you'll overheat them. Gotcha. They said hurry through twelve. Well, I think three thousand foot a minute is pretty good. So. Yeah. We'll try our best, huh? What's in and reason? is trim good? Yeah, feels good. All right. If it off. tries to roll, sometimes yeah. you have to do aileron trim, but it, I okay. think I got it close. Yeah. Right. I mean, let's see here. I mean, it's staying right. pretty close. Yeah. Approach, one, one, three, Romeo, the Oak's kind of weird. It wants to bounce back at you a little bit, huh? Number three, yeah. Romeo, Fox, right around it. Oh, and I should have put Number three, Romeo, Fox, right here. I'm going to put the confirm. autopilot on your side. All righty. We're going to go back. Uh, uh, v-NAV, flight level change. 100, three, Romeo, Fox, right. And then transponder should be on your side too. Alrighty. I didn't think about that normally. On. And those pitch UV bars. It'll do 220 on the dot if you're tucked in there tight, right? Alrighty. Oh, we made it through 12. Yeah. We can't do everything. We can either go climb fast or we can go fast. You there can't you do both. Yeah. Because there are some places they want you to do 250 knots to get out of the airspace. Right. So then I'm, you know, not talking about that. passing 4.5 on the next three. United 1791, Las Vegas, departure. And then we're country. pressurizing. Okay. And we always want to check that before we get too high. Usually it's shortly after takeoff, you know, right. that sidetrack. Right. And then my after takeoffs are landing gears up, flaps are up, throttles are in the climb detent. They are. Okay. Passenger safety I didn't do because nobody's on board. Exterior lights, I went to recog. Pressurization, it is climbing. We've got diff. Okay. And the altimeters are good until we get to 18. Now we, sure, then we go to standard. Climbing and maintain climb level 1 energy. Climb and stay in 190, Fentry Flight 286. That's it. Ah, she flies really nicely, doesn't she? It, uh, it's such a good flying airplane. It's so easy to fly, so it's fun to fly because it's so easy. Yeah. Some airplanes you don't want to fly visual because you're like, oh, I'd rather program it and have it do the auto, you know. Yeah. Like, and then above 28. Here's Joe Julia Waits, you maintain flight level 1 energy, Los Angeles Center on 124.85. G'day. 2485, we'll level at 19. Zero Julia Whiskey. On 2086, contact Los Angeles Center on 124. I don't know if it's 112 leaving flight level 260 descending to 240. See. Hello, this is 112. This is a welcome descent via the Rockstar 3, runway 26 left, for Las Vegas, or similar 2985. 29, that's 185. We will continue descent on Rockstar 3, arrival expecting 26 left. Are you going to Vegas? Vegas. The Rockstar 3 is. This is 112, thank you, sir. Thank you. Number 6. Number 67901. And I'll just wait. If I can't get in, he'll, he'll call me if I don't want to call him, right? This is Los Angeles. If it gets busy, yeah. Right. So Grand Canyon, Ultimate 2987. And what, is, what was your destination again? They got busy. All right, 2987, our, our, our destination. Once I start to level off at 19,000, do I go back to the cruise Delta. setting? You do. Okay. But well, it won't be any different. So it's really not all that important. All right. LA Center, citation 300, Julie Whiskey, 174, climbing 190. No, Mr. Wiggins, do, do that whiskey. I'll just say welcome. Come in, man. Step 230. 230, zero, Julie Whiskey. And we didn't have a lot of time to talk about it, but usually the guy not flying would do that, right? Yeah. You're flying. Right. Your hand flying, and then here it comes. It flashes a message to yeah. tell you to hit standard. Right. Standard. And then I turn off my light. All right. Because above 18, everybody's IFR. Yeah. So I'm leaving my light Class off. Alpha. Yep. Right. They're all good. Took my way back that way. We're going up to 23. But what I was going to say is, if huh. he gave me a heading, yeah, I would do that too. Okay, and I'll just follow it on here. And you'd follow it. Okay. But if you've got the autopilot engaged, then, okay. then that's your... Sw whiskey, not um, how's it right and come up? It's been smooth. Roger, thank you. So if the autopilot was engaged, then you're flying using the autopilot. So if he says, oh, turn left 20 degrees for traffic, yeah, I don't touch it because you're flying, right? Right. So you would... I got you. you would change it to heading mode, turn it, uh, okay. then it's your knob, right? All right. That's kind of the duties. When you're hand flying, yeah. who does what? Okay. Versus when the autopilot flies. Brazil, Julia Whiskey, come in, 10, with 290, 29. 290, Julia Whiskey. So then I would set it, 
Right, 29. LA Center, Riddle Center. And then I'd say 29, uh, and then you'd just say 29, uh, like you'd say, uh, okay. or you say, I see it. You know, people do it differently depending on who you're working for. Yeah. But the person that said it, because you might be busy, busy uh, uh, flying or whatever, or whatever. Usually not. The captain doesn't yeah. do it much. He's just flying, right? Yeah. Uh, the other guy's busy. Yeah. You can see how busy I've been yeah, LA, back yeah. and forth, right? Yeah. King Air 773 checking in. But I would set it, and if you just say, see it, or 29, some way to confirm that you see it. Especially if you're hand flying. Yeah. LA Center, Duke 640. Or if we were level at 20 and I set 29, uh, I'd have to say 29. You'd say, see it. And then you would be the one that okay. and, and cranks so the plane up, up or whatever. Yeah. Okay. be nice if he steps us all the way to 41 without down. stopping. Duke, yeah. Fair, Charlie. I said he's going to step up pictures it's, all the way up. It saves fuel. You can see we've already Duke made fuel. It said we were going to land with 600 earlier, now there's nine. We should have 1,100, 1,200 pounds at Mitchell Tower, probably. Yeah. It just because I didn't have the box fully, and it might not have had the XM winds yet. Okay. If I'm on a ground power car, like an hour before the passenger show, it's going to be pretty accurate because it would get the XM weather. It would know the winds are off. It knows everything. Yeah. But since we're kind of having a quick turn, it's uh, and it pulls up like the flight flight plane, you know, four flight. Yeah, it'll have all that in the box. Zero two gotcha. that whiskey contact always sent to one two eight point zero seven twenty eight oh seven twenty eight oh seven zero zero whiskey. And I can do it with the knob, or I can touch it. Okay, I prefer the knob. Just yeah, I can touch it. That, that the novelty that wore off, and then I just dial it. Center of citation, 300 Juliet Whiskey's 23-3, climbing 290. 300 Juliet Whiskey, LA Center, hello, climb maintain, flight level 330. 3 Juliet Whiskey. Oh, we're rolling. 3364, contact LA Center on 124.85. 2485, we'll see So we were just in roll mode the whole time. Uh, I didn't look at the scoreboard. I guess when I transferred it, it kicked it into roll mode. Okay, yeah, flight level 240. I'm just going to recenter you, right? See 289. But that is important to check the scoreboard, right? Right. If you've done something. That's the nickname for it, the scoreboard? Yes, the little scoreboard. Yeah, That's pretty that. much what they all do. On the autopilot settings are showing. And this is considered the AFCS, that. Autopilot flight control system or whatever. Gotcha. Allegiant uh, 58 contact LA Center on one. Most planes have it right there on the front. You know, even if you're pro line stuff, it's still got the basic knobs right up here in the altitude. Yeah. 2485, I'd say the rest. If it's a two pilot right, plane, usually the gears over there. And you can see it starts to fizzle out. We're doing 11 on or whatever, you know. Zero play level three zero zero. Our sign six zero, Alley Center, hello, reduce to two five zero. But we're warm, we're four degrees above standard. Reducing the speed to two five zero, polarity is nine six zero. And then above 28, you're yeah. supposed to be on autopilot, because we're in RBSM airspace. All right. But even if you're flying a cruise. Right. I've hand flown it at 40 something when the autopilot wasn't working. Yeah. You're not supposed to, you're supposed to say, yeah, I need to come down to 28. But we had to stay up there. We wouldn't have made it. Delta Echo we wouldn't have made it on the fuel, right? Because yeah. our fuel burn, look in the 20s, we're 580, almost 600 pounds a side. We're going to be three something at 41. Okay. So it's like half. Yeah, that's really burn. nice. So it's important to climb in all jets, really. Right. Turboprops, too, but they're not as bad. The, the difference between flying at 17 versus 25. It's not that big a difference in a King Air. Yeah. Whereas in a turbine fan, they're not efficient down low. They like the thin air. Ready to copy, A5 Zulu. For A5 Zulu, you're clear direct needles. That's and I keep the heading back center. The Disney 5 arrival, maintain bubble tree zero zero. Right, that's kind of my pet peeve. And direct needles, Disney It's kind of something five, they do teach you in school, too. They, you know, yeah. always center your heading back. Cause, you know. Aid situational awareness, you know. Plus, if anything goes haywire, I can always go to heading. Yep. And it's already flying straight. She's pretty quiet, too, isn't she? Yeah. The only reason they give you bows for these planes is because of our uh, bleed air for the windshield. Uh -huh. 
If I have to do the bleed airs, yeah. it's no very noisy. Gotcha. For 437 Mike Charlie, contact. I mean, you can still hear, but you hear the 4.85 yeah. when you turn it on. 24.85, so make sure to get it. All right, well, this was a wasted effort. I don't know what. Oh, my camera's. Oh, maybe I was recording. That'd be awesome if it was. Oh, it was recording, man. Hey, there it you go. It's 15 minutes. All right. You got to send me that one later. But what?